every day. Construction workers face workplace hazards that pose a significant risk to their health and safety. Some of these risks can result in serious consequences. Of all worker fatalities at work or as a result of work-related illness, roughly one-third are in the construction industry. Find zero-tolerance targets. Falls of more than three meters, ladder falls, contact with moving machinery, electric shock from a live overhead power line, collapse of scaffolding, collapse of an unshored trench, exposure to asbestos dust, exposure to silica dust, and unstable rocks. As an employer, you have certain responsibilities with respect to these targets. For starters, you must inform your workers of the risks associated with each task. You must train all workers to ensure they work safely and in accordance with preventive measures. You must provide them with safe equipment, tools, and work procedures. You must also supervise their work and ensure compliance with all safety standards. Your prevention program is the best way to meet your responsibilities. If you are in breach of the rules, you could face a full or partial work stoppage, closure of the job site, and statements of offense. More than half of all work stoppages, site closures, and statements of offense are issued in the construction industry. As a construction professional, you should already know how to identify, correct, and control the risks related to the zero-tolerance targets. Don't hesitate to reach out to the APCHQ for support and advice about your prevention process.